Hey guys, in this video we're going to be conducting two different experiments relating to the factors affecting liquid pressure. Let's go! The first experiment is about the relationship between the depth of the liquid and the pressure in the liquid. For that, we're going to need a plastic bottle, water, candle, a needle, food coloring, tape, lighter, and a ruler. Now let's check out the steps to conduct the experiment. Firstly, we're going to heat the needle over the flame and once it's heated, make three holes horizontally on the plastic bottle. Then, we need to tape those holes and label it. After that, add water and food coloring in the bottle. By adding food coloring, you'll get a better vision of the spur distance of the water. Now, we are ready to conduct the experiment. Remove each tape and observe the spurt distance of the water from each hole. From here, we see that the spurt distance from hole A is the shortest, Hole B is medium and hole C is the longest. The second experiment is about the relationship between the density of the liquid and the pressure in the liquid. For this experiment, we'll need two plastic bottles, water, candle, a needle, tape, lighter, a ruler, and oil. Now we can check out the steps to conduct the experiment. First, heat the needle and make a hole on each bottle. Then, tape the holes and pour the oil into bottle A and water and food coloring into bottle B. Since this experiment is about density, I chose two liquids with different densities that is oil and water. Now, we shall conduct the experiment. Take off the tape and observe the spurt distance of both liquid. Here, we see that the length of spurt of water is longer than the length of spurt of oil. Therefore, the higher the density, the greater the liquid pressure. 